welcome back to CAD CAM tutorial today we will see how to make different types of rectangle and center line so let's start create one geometry first sketch first new choose part okay now our uh, interface came uh, we will select one plane uh, let's select top plane sketch now go to sketch section and today we will study how many types of rectangle how to draw a rectangle in our plane and center line also so let's start from the rectangle after line there is a one tool rectangle but there are many options if we will click this down there are corner rectangle center rectangle three point three point rectangle and parallelogram so first we will choose corner rectangle how to draw a corner rectangle in corner rectangle just click any part of the plane and just drag it and see a rectangle created any part of see rectangle created it is very easy and give the dimension whatever you want that's it now we will see another part of rectangle center rectangle center rectangle means if you click any part see you can drag and it is started from center then again I will click here see ok it is showing the rectangle center rectangle in from any po point of view any point you can drag and drop a one good rectangle this is mostly used now see third three point corner rectangle this is little difference you just select one point then go to another point any point like uh, okay then drag it now your rectangle created now the same as choose this point this point and drag it at any angle ok it is very simple this is called three point corner rectangle the same as three point corner center rectangle select and we will create select one center point then drag it up to here then see it is same as this rectangle but it is quite different only the thing is you have to start from center point center drag little drag any any place and ok now it is our rectangle is created this is the center rectangle three point and the last one is parallelogram parallelogram is quite interesting suppose you draw one line see you can drag and drop in any direction this is parallelogram even you can drag back forward anything see in 36 degree you can draw a, any kind of parallelogram in parallelogram both the opposite directions are equal and parallel see this both the are equal and parallel this is the main aim of this tool ok so just select delete it and we will see what is the center line this is the center line only one center line we are using for reference point if we want to make any hole or anything so we will define as we will use it for reference line select one line this is the reference line you can make select this reference line choose for construction even you can select infinite infinite means no length see the second one select infinite see it created axis so this is just for a 
reference point select line and you can define for a dimension like uh, from center point to center point then choose smart dimension and assign dimension anything like this this is the main aim of the center line to just locate the position of any coming objects or part so please subscribe our channel for more videos and more projects in solidworks thanks for watching